Mecklenburg County under the gun to decide what new voting machines to buy. The state has mandated all counties to use equipment that produces a paper ballot, the hope being to counter any attempts to hack election results. NBC Charlotte's Rob Berkey checked in today to see what progress the county was making towards getting new voting machines. Rad. This is the kind of machine now being used in Mecklenburg County. The State Board of Elections, though, has approved three new companies that make new equipment. Mecklenburg County has to decide what equipment they'll pick. Mecklenburg County Elections Director Michael Dickerson tells me he has not made up his mind. No, I have not. As to which of three companies he favors to provide new voting equipment for the county. He says he will wait until after a presentation by all three companies that will be held in September. The vendors, the three vendors, will invite those three vendors here and they can show what they got. The three companies certified by the state to sell machines are Clear Ballot, Election Systems and Software, and Heart InterCivic. All of them, Dickerson says, will produce a ballot a voter can hold in his or her hands to verify the votes that person casts. This is all the stuff that we're going to be looking at, and this is what I'm looking forward to see what, what is out there, what products these guys have. The local elections board will recommend to the county commission which company to go with, and the estimated cost could run between 6 and $15 million. What I'm more concerned about is, is making sure that anything we get is is good for the voters of this county and the clock is ticking these old machines have to be replaced by the new ones by march the third for the north carolina primary just about six months away from right now at the board of elections red berkey nbc charlotte